January 19th, 2023. I grew up in this house right here. Over 23 years, my mom bought that first house. And this is the uh, friends I grew up with, Carl and Sylvia. They no longer live here. So is somebody living in the house? Some hoarders or just nobody? Oh, there's a fire? This, this, oh, really? Yeah. What's your name, man? Matt. Matt Veli Ray. Nice to meet you, bro. I'm born and raised in this neighborhood, you know. And this gentleman is letting me uh, record him in the neighborhood because this is what's going on. How you doing, man? Just doing a documentary on the neighborhood I grew up in. Born and raised, you know. I grew up in that house right there. My the first house my mom ever bought. Yeah, the one the, right there, 8809 Southeast Reedway. Congratulations to you. you, still, you still the I, still, I still live up the street. You know, I still drive by and see what's going on in the neighborhood. <clears throat> what's your name? Josh. Josh? Valley Ray. Nice to meet you, bro. Sure. How are things going for you out here? Just getting by, struggling, huh? Yeah. Anybody helping you to get a housing voucher or anything? Any community, act, community activists? Any community activists out here helping you? Not in the ways that people would traditionally see help you know, or, or they would think. okay if there's any community activists watching this they need to come to 88th and Reedway and come help these gentlemen and get them housing vouchers get them motels get them a place to stay because you you caseworkers aren't doing your job I'm getting a girl Jen Wall a brand new apartment today or tomorrow we're waiting on the caseworkers she's lived under a bridge for over four years yeah, yeah. over off of 92nd and Flavel oh, Jen? yeah you know Jen you do say what's up to Jen she's watching <laughs> yeah, I'm getting her off the street, bro. She don't need to be out here. She's a soldier. You know Jen, huh? That's dope. So how, how long you been out here for? Well, maybe, you know, my channel's growing big, bro. Maybe I can help you change things. You know, you're going to be you're, you're going to become one of my people on the channel. Nobody's looking for you, right? Your family looking for you or anything? No, no. Okay. A lot of parents are reaching out to me because you know Measure 110 passed and they decriminalize heroin and all that shit in small amounts. Yeah, yeah. so now it's it's gotten out of hand. A lot of parents, are their kids are missing now and they're contacting me and they want to find out where their kids are. They just want them to call home and just say hi. Like I'm looking for a girl named Tabitha Clark. Have you heard, do you know who Tabitha Clark is? Okay, she's 24, she's from Alabama, and her mom just wants her to call home, you know? So, maybe we can, you know, I can help you guys. Just me filming this and putting this, you know, what's going on in the community. The mayor is watching this. Yeah, mayor and governor. You guys see how they're eating out here? Why don't you guys come out here and help the people? You guys know exactly where this is at, too. Why don't you guys come out here? Quit doing press releases on, on, the, on a channel 12 and all this stuff. Like you guys are helping, you're picking up trash with those little things. Why don't you come out here and do real work? Talk to the people. I bought my dog those little squeaky toys. That's my dog's favorite squeaky toy, that little orange hog on the... Yeah. 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 So you are, are you here too? Yeah. All right. Well, thank you for talking to me, man. Yeah, I'm going to see if we can get these people some... Uh, you know, we're putting putting this on public notice. You know, the governor and the mayor, you guys are eating five-star dinners. And look how Southeast Portland has become. You guys are not investing back in the community. You're giving billions of dollars to other countries for no reason. Invest back into America, especially my city, Portland, Oregon, so we can live a better life. 2023.